A signature Vegito PSA 12? What? What is up, Joe Crew? It is me, Joku DMD, and oh my god, do I have something exciting for you guys today. My boy Jake Marks from Greg's Games, gotta love Greg's Games was cool enough to hook me up with a box of Assault of the Sands. Yes, it is true. We got a booster box of Assault of the Sands. It is sealed, minty fresh, and we are ready to strip this thing. There are some seriously hot cash cards in this set, and I am super, super psyched to pull some of them. I feel like I feel like we could get some of the cool signature rares or secret rares or something out of this set, and I'm just hyped for it. So uh, Without too much further ado, let's get into this. Oh, if this is your guys' first time here and you like what you see, please take the time to hit that subscription button. It really helps me out. And if you're a returning member of the Joe Crew, welcome back. And let's strip this box and see what we can get out of it. Hey. All right, so we got this booster box here, Basalt of the Sands. I got my dragon's knife and we are gonna strip them here. And it's, uh, ooh, yeah. Oh man, oh my god, I'm so excited. You know, I actually opened a whole case of this when it came out, but I haven't stripped one of these, and it's, uh, it is pretty hype here. So we got 24 packs here, and uh, I'm just, I am just so psyched. Look at the beautiful art on this box. It just looks so good. All right, let's see what we got here. Wait, what? Hang on. Uh, this doesn't seem like, wait, these aren't, uh, what the heck? Okay, so I guess let's we'll bless them the pack, I guess, there, bless them. This is weird, these don't look like the, I mean, I don't remember the Assault of the Sands packs looking like this. What? I mean, this says set seven on it. What the heck? This is, what? There's only three cards in this pack and none of them are foil. Wait, what's going on? Wait. They're supposed to be signature rares and secret rares. What? Is that supposed to have two signature rares? And, oh, what? This, this is a secret rare, and it's not even foil? What the heck? Okay, something's seriously wrong here. This doesn't seem... This does not seem right to, to me. I mean, Heartfelt's a good card, but it's not even foil. Wait. What is going on here? I mean, this Broly leader's cool. And there's another secret rare, but they're, bo bo they're both not foil. Wait. Hang on. I feel like maybe, like, we should at least get a secret rare and they don't want it. Then what is going on? This is not cool. Wait. This box is supposed to be like 1500. This box is supposed to be like 15 grand. And this is all just. I feel like. Wait, are these. Re wait, these are revision packs? Wait, what? This supposed to be. There's supposed to be signature rares in this box. Wait, this set's supposed to have signature. This set's supposed to have signature rares and secret rares. Wait, what? This is. I mean, this is. This is a non-foil secret rare. What? What the heck? This is a hoax. This, this is a hocus pocus. What? Is, what is this hoax? Wait. What is going on? These are n none of these are. None of these are from. Are, I mean, they have the ISRs from set. Like this is from set seven. Wait, what is going on here? Um, there's definitely supposed to be... Dude, this is the weirdest box I've ever opened. This is, like... This feels like a Bandai really messed up with this. This doesn't seem... Wait, this doesn't seem right. Wait, this seems, like, seriously wrong. I mean, there's... It's another... Why are all these... What's up with all these non-foil secret rares? Like... What? Like, what the... Uh... This doesn't seem right. Um... 
Uh, what's the, what is going on here? Uh, what the heck? Oh, oh. Oh, okay, at least, well, this is one of the secret rares from the set. I mean, this is like the, this is probably the least, like, rare. I think this is the cheapest of the secret rares, but at least, you know, I guess it's cool to pull one secret rare from the box. I mean, it would be cool if we could get another, at least, would be, like, cool, I guess. Oh, 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 all right, okay, cool, we got, we got two secret rares. So I guess that's not so bad. I mean, that's not bad. We got two secret rares out of one box. These packs are weird though. I mean, I guess we still have the blessing in the pack and there's this one other pack, so. Um... Oh, whoa, a signature rare. Oh, cool. All right, so we got a signature rare and we got two secret, I mean, that's that's pretty hype out of one box to get a signature rare and two. Oh, and we still have the blessing in the pack. Okay, uh, bless it, oh, bless it. Uh, I mean, it would be awesome if we could pull the Vegito Secret Rare. It would be, like, super cool. So, that would be, like... Okay, I mean, I'm feeling pretty... Whoa! Oh, my God! The Yo! Wait! Okay, what? Wait, what's going on? Hang on. We got... There was two Secret Rares and two special Secret... Um... Uh... What? Okay. Wait. So, there were both Signature and two... Secret rares? Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. This is the most insane box I've ever opened. What? Ooh, wait. Hang <laughs> on. Two signature rares. The Vegito special signature rare and the Trunk special signature rare? What? Oh my god, though. That is a, some serious hot cash. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, this is def this definitely looks like a PSA 10. Whoa, this for sure looks like PSA. Like this is this almost looks like a PSA 11. Whoa. Oh my god. Though. This is like this is the best condition. Whoa, and it even it even whoa, it even came in a sleeve. What? These packs are insane, dude. A signature Vegito PSA 12? What? Whoa, I've never seen it. I've never seen a secret rare as pristine as this. This might be a BGS like 15 or 16. And he's okay. Well, this is insane. I mean, this is like this is like 2K in cards right here. Hot, hot the hot the cash, Cardo. Whoa. Oh, okay. So this box was. I guess this is. I guess this box is insane. So shout out to Jake. Jake, thanks for hooking it up, dude. I mean. It's cool enough to get an Assault of the Sands box, but I was really thrown for a loop there. Um, this has been Joku DMD, and we just stripped like the most hot cash box I've ever seen. I mean, we just we just pulled we just pulled two signature rares, our two favorite special signature rares, and both secret rares out of one box. So that's that's crazy. Um, oh, and of course, uh, if you guys had a good time with this. Uh, shrip them please take the time to hit that subscription button it really helps me out and if you guys are returning members of the joe crew thank you for your continued support i am a dentist and i can't end the show without doing a dental tooth tip if you ever want to trick your friends into thinking that you lost a tooth or something like that it's a really good idea to get a retainer and just take a sharpie and color one of the teeth in with your sharpie and then it looks like you, you're missing a tooth and it's a great way to you know trick your friends into thinking like you're missing a tooth or something like that um and you know it is april fools so april fools you guys i hope you like my joke um please be safe on april fools you know if you uh decide to play some pranks just make sure you do something that's not going to hurt yourself or hurt one of your friends and take care of each other i uh, hope you guys had a good time with the shrimp and i will see you guys next time